I leave you this APC, and today I'm just making a quick video talking about HTML5. Thing, uh, the main thing I wanted to get across is that if you plan on getting any time, you, you'd better get sooner than later because right now it costs $100, which is a, a pretty high price, but it, it, once it, the full release comes out, it's, it's in beta now, so once the full release comes out, it's going to be $200, and it, if you buy it sooner, you'll save $100. So, um, why would you want to get it? Or what is HTML5, you may ask? Um, with the game maker HTML5, you you can compile the games and you can run them online like a Flash game. So you won't have to work with the Yo Games plugin, and you can distribute it more widely, which is which is really cool and, and is a, is a major thing. And the other thing that that stuck out with me was um, when you compile it, it doesn't compile as normal .gmk like you would expect. It compiles into a folder. Like here, I have one one um. And then compile to HTML5 test, and it comes out with all these folders. Now it has normal GMK right right here, and then it has the icon. But then it has the icon right here, so you can mess around with the icon more easily. And um, this help file is one second. Never mind. No, never mind. Not what I thought it was. Um, so then it has all these folders up here as well. So all your sprites stored in here. And if you want to edit them, all you need to do is have go in here and you can open your favorite photo editor and edit them. So um, the, you may think this, this looks a little more irritating, but it makes things a whole lot easier for um, development teams because they, they can go through here and they can send different pieces to each other rather than just rework the one GMK file. And then once you compile it, it comes out as this, and this is the web page one, and the actual exe. So if I run the web page one, you can see that I can, this is, my game's not working. This live video isn't working out too well. Oh well, you get the point. Another thing I want to say is, so those are the reasons why I should HTML5, but um, so nothing to keep in mind is that Game Maker. I mean, if you could look on the Yo-Yo Games website, Yo-Yo Games website. Anyway, if you go to Game Maker, Game Maker in Studio, this is new. They're going to release pretty soon, and it's going to be. Oh, whoops. Okay, and they're going to release it. And what I think is weird is that it says produce ready to run HTML web five web, web code, which means it can do the main thing that HTML five can do, which doesn't make much sense to me. And then on top of that, it can do the export iOS and Android program, which is really really cool. So, um, but if it's going to include th this part and this, it definitely cost more than two hundred dollars, and it could couldn't even goes like far as four five hundred dollars. So. So I don't know if you want to get that or not. They haven't announced the price yet, so I'm just speculating, by the way. So, um, I've told you why you sh might want to get a Game Maker HTML5. And so consider getting it if you want to, get want to get it. Or maybe if you're extremely into Game Maker, you might want to wait for Game Maker Studio. But uh, it's a little bit ambiguous about what exactly is going to include or not. So, uh, just a um, little announcement. Uh, Hope this wasn't too long. I hope it wasn't too unorganized, and um, I hope it was useful. Okay, bye.